So let's understand some basic concepts about gravitational force. So as we all know that all the planets in our solar system including Earth revolves around the Sun in their particular orbits and in the similar manner the Moon also revolves around the Earth in its own particular orbit. As we have heard that scientists sent many artificial satellites to make them revolve around the Earth in their particular orbits. Now another phenomenon we will discuss is of rain as we all know that rain falls from up above the clouds like from the clouds and comes downwards and fell on the ground. So the direction is downwards of the rain. Similarly you all have must play football. So whenever you kick a ball and it reaches up to a certain height for example this height and then follows the same path and again eventually reaches the ground. So. So this is the concept of the projectile motion. Now, the great scientist Sir Isaac Newton was once sitting under an apple tree and one apple fell on him and then the apple fell on his head and eventually on the ground. This, the felling of an apple made him realize and made him think that in all these events happening, there must be some common force of attraction which is acting between all these objects and the earth. That's why they are all, all being attracted towards the earth. And later when he discovered and when he experimented, he got the concept of the gravitational force. And this force of attraction between the earth and all the objects was later came to be known as the gravitational force. Now we'll understand the motion of moon around the earth in a much better.